Hi there, I'm Pete. Welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. We're in um, the, the Sandral compound and we've got to rescue uh, a, a kidnapped guy. Uh, if we go through this door... Right, can't go through that door. Can I go through another door? Or do I need to go around the back? I think, I think maybe I need to use that key to go around the back. Right, let's give that a try. So yes, I remember, I remember walking up to this door in a previous episode and thinking it must be significant in some way. I'm presuming this key gets us in. Indeed it does. Are we going to have to do any fighting in here? Apparently so. Right. Uh, a flash mine there. Uh, a droid there. Okay, let's... Um, right, I can't use stasis on the droid, but I can go in and do some critical striking. That worked nicely. Avoid the mine! Goodness gracious me. Right, what's in the remains? Some stuff. Right. Uh, can anybody here... Oh, yeah. It, yeah, he can recover a mine. That's good. That deals with that. No, skill too low. Can I disable it? There we go. All right. What? That's good. So, uh, a security room, a door that I can bash, another door, and I imagine there's a security droid around the corner. Oh, just a frag mine. Okay. Let's uh, let's start checking out some of these rooms. I think. Let's go from left to right. Right, a war droid. Oh, a few of them. Come on, everybody, fighty fighty. There's that one. And, and Zalbar, I'm just going to shift your attention onto this guy over here. If I may. Or you can just miss a few times, that's absolutely fine as well. Yes? Right, let's loot the bodies. If they have any bodies to loot. Uh, no, okay, another security room. More droids. Just the one. And boom. Okay, so we've gained access to another corridor. Droid medium plating type one. Well, that's nice. Um, it's it's kind of a bit maze-like, isn't it? I guess we just have to try every room. A uh, footlocker that I can bash open. What's in there? Med pack credits. Cool. Yeah, it's going to be a case of try every room. Uh, another security control room that's going to have droids in it. What else we got here? Is there a footlocker in here I can loot? No, there is not. Another security room. And let's get busy. Now, don't talk to Zalbar. Uh, oh, someone's got a disabled droid skill. That's nice. Uh, this one's faulty. We'll talk to him in a minute. The force fights with me. Cool. What? That was pretty good, wouldn't you say? Uh, what about this this faulty droid? I can reactivate it with one repair part. Um, and I need to spend some more to do what? Engage in patrol mode? That's quite expensive. Let's do it. It might help. Okay. And then let's go. Right, so he's going to run off and do some fighting for me, I'm hoping. It's a bit crowded in here, isn't it? Right, on that, that footlocker. Yeah, I want what's in there. The prison key. That's good. Right. Uh, this droid's patrolling. What's in here? Aha! Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I will take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Okay, it sounds like there's fighting happening. The halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only help. All right, uh, I'll go now. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. Yes, you keep saying that. Right. What? Okay, so the droids are fighting in there. I'll help. Uh, and Bastler, use your disable droid skill. Yes. Come on, fight, fight the droid. He might be disabled, but. He needs dealing with. Nice. 
A uh, bunch more foot lockers, lots of looting to be done. Okay. Oh, lots of them. Right, yep. Go on, everybody, do your bit. Our, uh, oh, there's more. Our, our healths are dropping somewhat. Yes. But uh, oh, he's going to open another door and start another fight. Oh, hello. Are you following me? I thought you said you couldn't come with me. Right. What's in the footlocker? Response package. And light scan visor and fragment. These all sound like fun things. So where have I not yet visited? Let's have a little check of the map. Uh, I think, is that where I was? Maybe I need to... Oh, this is tricky. Right, it's the faulty world droids wandering around there. What's around this corner? Bunch of open doors. It's looking a bit like we've... So that's where we came in, so maybe I need to be around here somewhere? I uh, haven't been this. Okay, there's a frag mine, right? So, yeah, there's 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 more places to check out. Um, yeah, you need to disable that mine again. Be very careful. Okay, what? satisfactory. So, what's in here? Right, can't go in there because I'm not a family member. This door's bashable. Maybe this is where we need to be. One more bash, please. Who are you? What do you want with me? Are you working for my father? I'm here to rescue you, Shen. Rescue me? No, I won't leave. It's too dangerous. I'll protect you, Shen. Let's go. It's not my own safety I'm concerned about. I'm worried about the fate of Nurik's daughter, Rahasia. She's been trying to convince her father to release me ever since I was captured. If I escape, Nurik will think Rahasia is to blame. Nurik is insane with grief over the loss of his son, Cassus. If I leave with you, it is Rahasia who will suffer. I cannot allow that. Okay, he's got a point. Um, what if we take Rahasia with us? If you can convince Rahasia to escape with us, I will accompany you. Though I do not know if she'd be willing to turn her back on her home and family. Who could imagine a Sandra doing such a thing for the sake of a Matali? Oh, it's all Romeo and Juliet, go, isn't it? Then I too shall stay. I would rather face my own death than have her face her father's wrath because I escaped. Okay, I'll go speak to Rahasia. Thank you. I wish you luck. Right, so she was back around here-ish a little bit. Just in here, not very what far are you to doing go. Here? Have you found Shen yet? I'm trying to rescue Shen, but he won't leave without you, Rahasia. Shen can be so stubborn sometimes. If one of the security droids sees me wandering the halls, father will get suspicious. I can't risk it, but I know Shen would rather die than leave me here alone to face the wrath of my father. Tell Shen I will meet you outside the gates. I will wait as long as I can, but you must hurry. Okay, we have a plan then. So, Shen was back here. In this little red room. You're back. Have you spoken to Rahasia? Yes, she promised she would meet us outside the gates. I pray she is not just telling me what I want to hear. But I will have to take that chance. Hurry then, we must not keep Rahasia waiting. Shen, you're safe. Rahasia! Well, thank goodness you managed to escape. It was all thanks to this kind Jedi that we managed to get this far at all. I thank you, Jedi, for all that you have done for us. It was no problem. No, we know that you must have gone to great personal risk to get us out of the Sandral state undetected. No reward is necessary. But surely we can... Oh, what's this? Oh. Oh, oh. There you are, Shen. Father. Mr. Matale. Rahasia. Father. Mr. Sandril. Nurik. Alan. I knew this was all your doing. I knew you had captured my son. You had taken my Cassus from me long before that. You started it. I don't want to hear any of your excuses. Now I will get revenge for your transgressions. All right, I need to talk them down. Um... So not that. That's that's a little bit naughty. You two just need to calm down. Please listen to him, Father. Why should I listen to the Jedi? 
All you want is to remain with that sandral harlot. My daughter is not a harlot, Matale dog! Why don't you try listening to your children? Our children don't know enough of what's good for them to make a reasonable decision. It's better to let older, wiser heads like ours make the decisions. Raheji and I don't want you to make decisions for us. We want to live alone away from you. You... you insolent boy! If you want to live alone, then so be it! I disown you! Never set foot in my house again! Shen, dot dot dot. I don't care. Raheji and I will live on our own if you won't accept us. You will do no such thing! I am your father, and I order you to come back with me! No, father, I won't. Rahesha, you will not leave with this... this Matale boy! I am, father, and you can't um, stop I... me! We're leaving for I'm the not sure if I'm calming you things. You foolish girl! Things seem... To... right, um... Let them go. Let them go. You expect us to just let them leave? Droids, uh -oh. stop them! You will not turn your droids on my no, daughter. No, don't. Droids, don't let them take Rahesha. We appear to be at an impasse then. And they got away. It is your fault, Alan. Okay, you I think these guys might be turning a goods. corner here. Me? You were the one who rushed here we go, here right. Communication at last. You don't need to fight anymore. I will not rest until I have my Shen back. Oh. The Council will hear of the troubles you cause, Jedi. Indeed they shall. Oh, that's bad. Right. Journal entry added. Experience points received 600. Light side points gained. Items lost. What did I lose? I don't know. How did, did I do well on that quest? I felt like I did quite badly. Okay, right, what have we got on the quest log anyway? Need to investigate the ruins. And there's still some Mandalorian raiders around the place. Well, let's let's um let's head towards the ruins. So let's head back up this way. I get the impression that was the kind of quest where there were many possible outcomes, similar to the one in the previous episode. And I probably managed to get something reasonable. Maybe am I going the right way? What does the map say? Yeah, I think I want to head up towards that little nugget over there. What a nice little bridge. Any cat hounds to give me trouble? It's not seeming too houndy. Oh, there we go. Talk of the devil. Right, stasis on you. And... Maybe I should... Yeah, let's... let's Okay, so he's, he's stasis He needs to be stasis Did my stasis fail? Well, those two over there aren't joining in, at least. Right, uh, you need your flurrying, my dear. And rapid shot from you. Oh, stasis did work. Right, am I, am I fighting the guy who's giving me a tough time? Right, okay, Bastler's charging in. We need to charge in as well. Critical strike. Oh, she's used a power. Right, I, I want to cancel those and, and go for the one who's actually moving. There we go, this is a good strategy. Yeah, and then deal with that cat hand over there. Look at us go, we're awesome. Uh, and I think, yeah, I'm, I'm in the right place now. I think I want to head north through this. Okay, cat hound incoming. And, yeah, okay, uh, let's go in and do some striking. You know what? Have they seen me yet? I'm not sure if they have. Oh, they've seen us. Right, okay, fight, fight. Yeah, deal with him. And then the last one. All right. Yeah, our, our approach to the cat hounds is, is good. I like that. What have we got here? Some remains. Ooh, quite a lot of stuff in here. Cassius's diary. I wonder if that's telling. How do I check that out? In my inventory, I guess. 
This is the diary of Castle Sandra, an amateur archaeologist. It details his efforts to discover the source of the ancient ruins found across the surface of Dantuin. Upon reading it, you gather that he had some he had found some correlation between the ruins and something called the rack. The rack, eh? Is that a... So there's a Cathan just stood there doing nothing. Some up there stood there doing nothing. Okay, uh, well, I'm going to engage this one here. Because otherwise he's going to engage me. Bastard is useful to have on your side in the fight. Is that one over there going to join in? He's kind of heading this way. Let's move. Let's move out of his line of sight as quickly as we can. To the courtyard. Am I lost? Have I been here before? Okay, I've been here before. That's where the ruins are. Excellent. All is going according to plan. Yes, I did plan this. It's not just luck. Right, Cathan's approaching again. Yeah, I guess we have to. Just the one? Right, yeah, I'm, I'm not afraid of Cathan's. Though I am afraid of these strange ruins. So... I'm saving before I go in here. Strange ruins. Let's head on inside. Okay. Yeah, the, these are strange. And there's a door. Oh, is that... Yeah, okay. No, I was wondering if that was a... An ancient droid. Let's talk to the ancient droid. Hmm. Yeah, I don't recognise that. Um, what language is that? What are you trying to say? Well, that's a different language. I wonder if eventually he's going to cycle around to one that I can understand. Bastila, do you have any idea what this droid is saying? I think the droid is trying to communicate with us by cycling through a variety of languages. Each time it spoke, it was using a very different alien dialect. The droid can probably understand us. The only problem is it may not have been programmed with the phenomes of a language we can understand. I can reproduce any of the languages spoken by the slaves of the builders. Well, that's the one we're using, then. Hey, I understood that. I recognize this language as well. It's an archaic variant of the Selkath dialect spoken on Manan. But why would a droid on Dantooine be programmed to speak ancient Selkath? Communication was vital to ensure that the slaves constructed this temple according to the wishes of the builders. But you are not of the slave species, neither are you of the builders. You are like the one who came before. It must be referring to Revan. The Dark Lord and Malak likely encountered this droid when they explored these ruins. What are you? Why are you here? I am the Overseer. The Builders programmed me to enforce discipline among the slaves while this monument to the power of the Star Forge was constructed. All, at project completion, all slaves were executed. I was reprogrammed to serve should a Builder return in search of knowledge of the Star Forge. What is the Star Forge? The Star Forge is the glory of the Builders, the apex of their infinite empire. It is a machine of invincible might, a tool of unstoppable conquest. Sounds like a MacGuffin of major proportions. Um, but what is it? What does it do? The Star Forge is the glory of the Builders, the apex of their infinite empire. It's a machine of invincible might, a tool of unstoppable conquest. The droid is obviously not programmed with the knowledge we seek. The Star Forge sounds like some type of weapon, perhaps. Though in fact, it could be anything. Could it have been a factory or weapons plant? Maybe. That might explain how the Sith were able to amass a fleet so quickly. But I suspect the Star Forge is more powerful than a mere factory. Maybe the droid has more information we can use. It seems to respond to you. Perhaps you should ask it something else. Who are these builders you keep talking about? The builders are the great masters of the galaxy, the conquerors of all worlds, the rulers of the infinite empire, and the creators of the Star Forge. These builders must have been an extinct people. Though it is strange, there's no record of their existence. Even the archives of the Jedi Academy make no mention of them. In the years before the Republic, the Huts were a dominant force in the galaxy, but they never constructed an empire. In fact, I know of no species that would fit with this information. Hmm. 
The droids speak Selkath, maybe they were the builders. The Selkath were nothing but slaves and servants of the true masters. Like all the other species, they bowed down before the might of the builders and the star forge. The empire of the builders is infinite and everlasting. None can stand against their might and the power of the star forge. Have you seen a builder recently? I have been here ever since the completion of this monument. In all this time, no builder has returned to seek information on the Star Forge. How long have you been here? My chronological circuits have marked over ten full revolutions of this system's outermost planet around the sun since the builders left. Ten revolutions would take more than 20,000 years. Oh my. If this is true, then this droid is nearly 5,000 years older than the Republic itself. That's old. There must be some mistake. There is no mistake. The builders constructed my chronological circuitry using the technology of the Star Forge itself. My calculations are infallible. Um, what is your purpose here again? He just told me. Where can we find the Star Forge? Now that the slaves are gone, my purpose is to aid those who seek knowledge of the Star Forge, if they are worthy. The ones who came before you, the ones like you, not builders but not slaves, sought knowledge of the Star Forge and its origins. They proved themselves worthy. They discovered the secrets of the Star Forge locked beyond the sealed door behind me, but there was another who failed to unlock the secrets and paid the ultimate price. The droid must be talking about poor Nemo. The council sent him here to investigate, and it cost him. His oh, life. Nemo! I spoke to him. Um, did you kill the Jedi over there? I am not programmed for combat. I did not harm the one who failed. This temple's own protections will destroy those who seek knowledge of the Star Forge if they are deemed unworthy. How can I prove myself worthy? Enter the proving grounds to the east and west. Within them, those who understand the will of the builders can unlock their secrets and open the doors. But those who fail will be destroyed by the power of the temple itself. More than this, I am not programmed to say. Revan and Malak unlocked the sealed door and uncovered the secrets of the Star Forge. Now Malak is using the Star Forge to fuel his conquest of the Republic. We have to find out what they uncovered. We have to find a way to unseal these doors to learn more about the Star Forge. The Republic is depending on us. Well, my, my. Okay, well, that's exciting, and it might have to wait for the next time, because it's reaching that time again. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Shall I say next time one more time? I'm going to say next time one more time. Next time!